Good day, Mzanto. Welcome to another episode of the Youth Movement with myself, Unal Tano Akonendalana. And I'm in there to again. I'm going to put the best snob. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm put the best snob. I'm put the best snob. Snob, 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 snob. Snob buffet. You would snob buffet. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. So, guys, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please make sure you do and comment and share the interview. So, guys, can I have the introduction? Who are you, Nenzani, and all? Okay, my name is Lebukhang Mungani, based in Tladi, yeah, aka Poe Kabadi, but for two things, as a snob, as a soul, as a second name, yeah, sure. Mina, by name, I go to Tebukhomutabi, Tebukhomutabi, Kimukwena, I represent Bakwena, and then Estrate Nuzitani, Matala Zeti, Zinja 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 Zinja, and my last number is Sikrineni. And then uh, just a brief intro about myself, I'm just a young creative, Opul Opila Ekasi, and I'm trying to cultivate young minds, Zinja, Zabashana Ekasi, to, to be better people, basically. Um, thank you very much. Sorry, guys, we are outside here, so the sound won't be perfect because people are passing. But anyway, we'll try by all means so that we deliver isn't a clear and all. So, guys, let's talk about a snob. Is this a snob? Is this the snob or what's going on? Y yes. Uh, so, I would say this is just a glimpse of what we dubbed wood snob so wood snob uh, it's a second it's a second hand clothing store but we just don't sell clothes we are more so a social organization in terms of creating like opportunities for for young for young creatives that are mostly independent uh, and are into studying their careers, especially more in the arts and creative industry. So what we do with clothes, it's, it's a form of expression, like uh, it would snob, it's like a lifestyle of vulgar every day, usule, usule and look nice. Okay. Okay. So you don't have anything to add? Okay, it would snob, too, it's all about Oh, it would snob buffet too. It's all about dress nice all the time and we a confident to talk a young kid. We have a name to be a young kid. That's very, very nice. So let's talk about when this started, how and all. Oh, isn't it doesn't jump? So, so uh, the, the business started, uh, it was still mobile. So when we started, we were actually more so a, a bookstore. So the dream was to have a bookstore, a koneni, a kas, so that we could wake up every day, see a bookstore, a bookstore, a koneni, because that's where we spend, we spend most of our time. And from that, we grew into having clothes. Because clothes, obviously, naturally, it's something that gravitated towards, okay, let's implement this to, 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 to the business, to grow it, okay. to show people that in terms of clothes, you, you don't have to buy maybe a certain brand or you can just go thrift, buy something uh, sustainable and cheap, and then we, we flip okay. and, and be good with it. Yes. Yeah, I can see he, 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 the the mannequins over here looking good. <laughs> they looking good, yeah. Yes, I yes, have yes, to say. Yes, yes. I was I was his best snobu, but but confident. Cause I'm sure to go there. I'm not just the orange. I'm short. I'm yellow. I'm not mobile. I'm not snobu. Yes. So uh, tell me, did you tell me when it started? The, the actual date and all the time. Okay, so in terms of the actual date, we, 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 we pre-COVID, it started 2018. That's when it was still mobile. And then at the time, we, we were still wood teens. That's when we were running the bookstore. Like, uh, we were more so in, in pushing literature, uh, Malokshini, 
mwogngetisa abantwana ama homework and then from there it grew to clothes basically from abantu where did you get this where did you buy that and then you see let, let's be the the the, the cotton prickers abasekasi and supply people nje ngesitize sinsimbo okay um so you're saying it started last year ne 2018 Take me through that process from 2018 up until now, because remember back near COVID and Abanda Bapangeli and also Nienzenja, I can't give Paza Mr. Londo financially and all. Yes. So in terms of that, I could say like it's it's been like. I don't want to say a beautiful struggle, but I'll say a beautiful journey, cause. Italy, it was not a business. It, it's just a lifestyle. Young soul, sabanta wa funda. Young soul, fundu zinoati. That's knowledge. And uh, I just wanna say something for the internet. To guti, <laughs> guys, this thing you guti. If you know, you know that that's not culture. Ukendri kuchilo. That's not culture because why? For me, if you know, you share. And sharing is caring. And caring is living. Living is loving, buffet. So and loving is being sustainable. So. From that, sharing knowledge in what this is fundile to being formal, it took like a lot of steps. And then when things started to operate, la, we were still outside pre pre ama mask, you know, all that. We operated the mama in Gakul, and we I'd say we were thriving because why mostly go go mama kid, what you find. It's match, merchandise, merchandise, young so Tina, we are more so conceptual. We bring sneakers, add pieces from uh 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 to I'm a creative way to Eka. So you see we have some like some nice art pieces by a supplier and also and and with that we were able to to stand out. Guma market, stand out, thrive, and then COVID happened so Everything Yavala, like just that allowed ourselves to go, I'd say personally, dig deep, deep into like what we are doing. Are we just doing this for the cool to be nice, dress, or are we trying to like do good or be the change we want to see in the world? Because I, I think that is so imperative to be the change you'd love to see in the world. Oh, so you guys are saying we also have artwork. Can I see that again? Like, Kwanza Gan, Alpha guys, please explain to me. Kwanza Gan, John. Okay, so in terms of these pieces uh, from the creative, this is Soseguye. Yena. She mentioned because it's actually a lady. Shout out, shout out to all the women who are pushing art, doing art there. We see you. Shout out, <laughs> shout out. She says she is like pushing a abstract practice, okay. yeah, or doing abstract painting. And then uh, the, the orange piece that we see there, it was part of a show oh. that she did doing an ode to. Like a crash, like like not to say we are scale or fundili at we crash, and then she like didn't owe to her roots where she started with art. So we we trying to like just empower, yeah, 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 yeah. We give other people platform because Nazi thingy platform. Like we need other people to put us on. So we believe if you wanna be put on, put us on, yeah. <laughs> you guys are hearing him. Anyway, if you are new to the channel again, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and comment. channel, let's subscribe. It's 100k. Guzo again, Zagala something is snob, nas. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you've heard it. So, guys, um, let's talk about the business. Let's talk about the snob. Do you guys get um, e customers? Like, how how did you guys start it? Did you get e funding and all? Let's talk about this. Wasn't doesn't John? 
Um, did you guys receive a funding or you just started? Because remember, there are many people about Funukwan's business, but they like, no, we don't have capital, snaman, snaman. So how did you guys do it? So in terms of, I, I love that question because it's a good question. It speaks to the journey as it as you would snob. Because when we started, we were also like that. Ah, for us to start business. To a, to a point where we had to invest our time first. And by investing time, meaning you are doing land or leo to Funuguyens. And as Funuk by a num rep, we are rep again. 10,000 hours, we are rep. So we had to, to, to pull our like own resources. How much do you have? 20 rand, I am in 20, I was taking a pilot, 5 rand, 5 rand. So we had to invest our own money in the business and to be quite honest in terms of his nopu i love that we understand that we are not yet at a point where we are like a profitable company and we also understand the statistics so good see in south africa like i'm a startup they 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 don't survive more than five years so we basically are still like building the foundation hence like it's not just about selling clothes even though things in past are like we give people it's a my quality like you should look at sister rough luren quality not polo south africa rough luren the original if you know you know no if you don't know you don't know <laughs> Okay, guys. Um, okay, let's talk about. Are you guys artists? Or are you just selling? Okay, my friend will answer. I mean, I'm a friend ambassador. Okay. Eut snob. Okay. Yeah. So I model. I say eut snob. I follow on Instagram. Boy, kavari. Then on Facebook. Boy, kavari. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so for me, I'd say firstly, I'm an art scholar. I'm studying art, it's a BA majoring in music, in history and society, as well as the archives and records management. Uh, by, by night, I'm a runner, health is wealth, wealth is healthy. Uh, spare time, I'm, in Zani. I'm creative. So. So I'd say, art is my life. Okay, guys, I hear you. Um, again, please do bear with us. The interview is outside. We had to visit a snob. We couldn't bring them a studio. We wanted to see. Oh, but what's a snob? Snob, So, a shop, does it open every day or it's only week weekends? What's going on there? Okay, so in terms of a shop, currently, like, uh, during the week, it's, it's mobile. And then weekends, we, we, we're doing a pop-up. And then we also affiliated Nama Markets and Zoba Plaga, obvious, Creative Rustic Sundays. We are stroller every first Sunday, Topa Topa. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the youth movement. It's like entrepreneurship. It's not like a young soul. It's a young soul. Yeah, that's, that's dead. <laughs> yeah, Professor Snap, we are dead and leaving the mic. <laughs> but it's all good. I got you. Don't worry. So, um... Did you mention e Uba um, where's this place and where people can find you and all? Let's talk about that. So if uh, somebody ufuna who's a shopini, like when's an Yes. So so I think firstly 
Firstly, uh, we are this Tolagale PK, keep this Pabin Kitchen at Ladi, deep, 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 so where to second any, that's where you find us. And then on the net, it's wood snob at wood underscore snob. In spell it, guys, it's H O O for orange and then D, yes, underscore Hilele, your pansy, snob. S N O B, snob, guys. That's where you find us. Uzotola, email, you contact us. We quick to reply, young Tola. Collaboration in anything J that's community driven, you, you link us there. If you want some nice threads, you link us there. We're nice. Okay. Um, all right. So let's talk about somebody or Sengini or Funukala. But at you know, you know what? I don't have resources, I don't have money, I don't have nothing. Guys, can you talk to that person? Here is Wood Snob. You guys can be like us, you can start without the capital. Because now I've been telling people that you can do almost everything or anything without money. But to be honest, money is needed. We all need money to survive. So for you guys, um, you started from 2018 and your business sometimes they are pop, sometimes it doesn't. How did you guys survive? Let's start there. How did you guys survive? That's a deep, deep question. Uh... First, I'll say we are grateful that we survived it, hence we are here. So with the grace of God, because uh, that's the first thing to being a successful person or business person, entrepreneur, by living. When you have a life, then with that life, you align it with what you claim you want to do, want to do do, desire to do, yen to be. Because the reason I'm saying I'm grateful today is because here I am, a Konen, doing something that's related to a youth movement. That's all about wood snob. Agna, check, mali, engene lapo. Those will come with time. Meaning, I think... We as entrepreneurs, sometimes we want to have like 100K for a business, but you have not spent time with 100K towards that business. I believe it doesn't make sense in a way. So, my somewhere like. Go, go, go ask someone who's doing the thing you're doing. Or a great way actually to start, I know, is to go do research. Go do research on any and everything you want to do first. Um, okay, thank you very, very much. Can you guys um, sell the business to your people? Sell the business, tell people about everything about the business. Buffet <laughs> So, I'm going to check out the magazine. 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 It's being a good person, man. Always do something like support. Support our entrepreneurs. Now we also support. And then we also promote illiterate. So there's this book. Uh, now nah, it's by Mpomuloto. I highly recommend this book. It's called From the Township. And then I can just read a brief 
ngapha emuva yakhona yes so it's it's nature versus nature one way or another you'll always become your environment at least that is what science tell tells us but who is he who so transcends that environment and what tools does he have at his disposal that have allowed him to break down and break through all obstacles and cognitive chains that were shackles by the agents of the past. With the aid of principles of psychology from the townships, dissects and explains the environment of a of a black person. I won't say black man, but black black man, a black person. See <laughs> inclusive a snob. See inclusive who like we we are about the current politics, pop culture, what's happening. Young so Linda Basga is a broken Rihanna. We like made a be aware about what's happening. And we believe that currently we live in a global village. So it's important not as black people to, to change our environment. See when the better Linda Bale Guti we the mission mele Those are the missions and visions the snob. Okay. Okay guys, um I did I remember you mentioned he handles Zako. Did you mention yours? Let's so, let's let's yeah, start again yeah, yeah, with yeah, those yeah, yeah. where people can follow you. We follow, we follow, we buy into. So um, I'm I'm not really big on the net, but uh, my earliest name we are on Facebook Nova Sex, oh yeah, the Nova Safunda Sex Sekeleza. So let me teach you. Sex is S A C H S, not the one that you were thinking. Take your mind out of the car, something um man. Yeah, Nova Sex, that's where you find me. Okay, Minamu Kabadi, Facebook Kungtola Corner, yeah, Facebook Boy Kabadi, then Instagram Boy Kabadi ninety-eight. Okay, before um we go, before I wrap up, can I ask Obu Tibasunob uh like to stand up and then you guys you guys are gonna see them. <laughs> <laughs> so can I ask you guys to actually stand there and then the camera pick you up, camera pick them up. <laughs> okay, so Fandach is not was pulling on obviously as the classic jacks, classic jazz, so Connie Jazzy, Ama Cot Roy, Axinoma, he caught Ranger, Ralph Luren, Zoisho Foods, then do not polo South Africa, Ralph Luren. Check the tag in front of you, Paul, Ole. And then, obviously, classic, vintage. Navy care. Navy care, my logic. Young Tual coming with some oak patients. Young Tual has support and a man. I'm a business, a club and friends, you know. Yeah, sure. I know you have all of my feet. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Yeah, I'm a fan. 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 Yeah, I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Yeah, I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. Don't forget to subscribe. Yes. Andred, 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 subscribe. Andred, 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 the 1,000 subscribers. Yeah, sure. All the Andred, way Andred, from... Um, take it to the top. All the way from Thadi, yes. a snob, with myself, Unol Sanon Undalana, and... Lebuka Mungani. Pweka Badi, ezi nyi zinja, wea zi matala zi zu zet zet zamba. Subscribe, subscribe, and subscribe. Bye. Bye.